Hello, peoples. This is Philip, and this is my review of the movie The Good Liar, starring Ian McKellen and Helen Mirren. It's a movie about an aging con artist, professional con artist, who eyes a woman in the hopes of romancing her to get her life savings. It's uh, a story that's been told um, many other times, but this one has, you know, a few twists in it. Uh, the performances by Helen Mirren and Ian McKellen are excellent because they're excellent actors. Um, the story itself, um, it's a good story. Not great or even excellent. It's a good story. Uh, there are some supporting characters who were pretty good. There's some there are some dealings with criminal underworld, um, but um, so far as the movie goes, it's your basic mystery. It's a mediocre mystery, though. It's the kind that doesn't give you the audience all the clues to actually figure out the ending. It just, you know, at the end of it, it gives a big reveal and a bunch of exposition that you'd have no idea of knowing from actually watching the movie. That's that's uh, a sign of many mediocre mysteries. The, you know, the great mysteries are the ones that give you all the information to figure out who done it or why they did it. By the end, they just use the actor's performances as a way to distract you from the clues so that you don't realize it until the end. And, you know, things like, you know, movies like uh, The Usual Suspects, you know, when you realize at the end, oh, I could have seen it all along, but I was just so engrossed that I didn't. But this is a good movie and, you know, you'll have a good time. The Good Liar.